Hi, welcome and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you can tell by the title, we're gonna be doing at home brow tinting. So I was sent a cute little package from Brow Code, if you guys aren't familiar with who they are. Um, they're, I, at least I thought they were pretty well known in the brow industry for like tinting and their brow products. I first discovered them off Instagram and TikTok, but they reached out and they wanted to send me their brow henna kit. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's actually pretty cute, it's heavy. And they also sent me their Define and Line 122 brush. I don't know why this looks all scratched up like this, but whatever. This is what the packaging looks like. The packaging includes the five henna capsules, rose water fixing solution, brow conditioning cleanser, brow gold, brow serum, brush, and a mixing dish. Let's open this. I got it in the shade dark brown. Oh, this is really cute. It comes with five capsules, so I guess this is a really nice packaging where you can put it back when you're done so you don't like lose the things that you need. I have gotten my brows tinted before, so this isn't something that I'm unfamiliar with. And then the packaging for the brush, like, can we talk about this? I thought this was an eyeshadow palette. I was like, they saw eyeshadow? This is a packaging for a brush. This is so cool. And this is the brush. I'm gonna assume this is the henna brush. So this is what we're gonna use. Shout out to Vanita for doing my eyebrows yesterday. Because there's there was no way I was gonna be able to do this with my eyebrows the way that they were looking. So they they even put a QR code on the inside of the packaging so you can scan and watch a tutorial if you don't want to read the instructions. So I read the instructions, I pretty much know what to do. I'm going to take the cup and the capsules. The capsules come in the gold jar. I can't open it. Darn. I can't open it. Yo, I can't open this. Oh, I got it, okay. So this is what it looks like. Scissors. Okay, so we're gonna take one of these out. Little capsules, I'll put them down on the side. I'm gonna close this so it's airtight. I don't know if, if air gets in, it'll dry it out. I don't know. So we're gonna leave that tightly sealed. We're gonna open one of these capsules and put it into this dish. That's what it looks like. Now we're gonna go on with 10 to 12 drops of the rose water into the mixture. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I'm gonna take the brush that came in the kit to mix it together. And basically, you're supposed to make a smooth paste. It's hard to see because it's dark brown and then the actual bowl is black, but this is kind of what it looks like so far. And make sure there's no little... Um, balls in there we want basically everything to be the same consistency i think we're good on the mixing so we have to let it sit for 15 minutes in the meantime there is some skin prep that we have to do what we're going to do is we're going to cleanse our brows with the brow conditioning cleanser that's in this packaging here it's basically just to get rid of any makeup dirt that might be in our brow hairs and then afterwards we're going to go in with the brow scrub this is gonna exfoliate the skin. Some people have dry brows, so I can understand. Get rid of any flakes, any dead skin, anything that might be in our brows after the cleanser that may prevent an even application. So we're gonna do that. Oh, it's like creamy. And I am gonna do one brow at a time. So 
you guys can see the effects of the henna before and after now that that's done I'm gonna go in with a dry cotton round and wipe off the cleanser next up is the brow scrub so let's open this up comes with a ooh, smells good too wow i'm gonna take whatever's on the cap think about this much i don't know if this is enough but this is what we're gonna do and scrub and scrub it does feel like it's exfoliating it has like little grains in it so that's good And for the scrub, it says to be removed with a damp cotton round, so that's what we're going to do. Alright, so we do have a few minutes still for the henna to be completely set. So I'm going to wait, and then I'll just be back when it's ready. To apply, I'm going to be using the Brow Code Define and Line. 122 brush this brush is extremely soft and it really looks like it's really good for like it's a liner and brow powders it's super thin too so let me get my hand mirror and then we'll jump into it so i'm basically gonna do it like how i do my brows on a normal outline it and then fill it in so let me get the right angle My hand is in a weird position, guys. I'm sorry. That's the best way I can do that. Now that it's outlined, I'm going to fill it in with the paste. Any little mistakes I go on, I'm going in with a damp Q-tip just to fix any places where I feel like I might have gone out of the shape that I want. And I don't know if this is like any other, any of the other brow hennas that I've used, but I'm gonna put more product on the tail because I want the ends to be darker. And I'm gonna go really lightly in the front. Okay, after cleaning up, this is a really good shade. <laughs> Let it process for about 15 to 20 minutes. So I do feel like one part of the brow is a little dry. So I am gonna go in with some of the rose water to touch it up. Don't want it to dry down. Lesson learned, I put too much of that rose water, so I'm going to go back in with more of the henna paste, just so I still have an even application of product. So I'm going to let this sit for 15 to 25 minutes, probably 20, I'm just going to do a good even 20 and i'm gonna keep touching it up with the rose water as needed okay guys as you can see my henna is completely ready i'm gonna grab some water i'm gonna grab some water on a cotton round and dampen it wipe from front 
to tail of brow. Okay, I think I'm gonna like this already. So they said not to scrub back and forth for the reason being not to um, remove the henna from your skin so this <laughs> guys I've done brow tinting but I haven't I haven't used henna I've done like actual like regular tints you guys this looks good this looks good look this looks good I'm not gonna lie, it took a little while, but I think it's because I wasn't exactly sure how to use them. Like, I know the general idea of how to do it, but I didn't know how their ingredients work. And guys, this looks so good. Okay, so we're gonna do this side now. I'm gonna do it off camera. Um, at least I'm gonna speed it up or something. This looks so All right, we're going to take off this side. I cannot believe how good this looks like. You guys it lasts up to 14 days and I think this is this is what I'm gonna be doing Wow I have to do my eyebrows for two weeks okay to be fair I think this side came out better because I just had the practice in but I really like the way this came out I don't know how to do my eyebrows for the next two weeks. Oh my goodness, I could cry. Thank you so much, Brow Code, for sending me the goodies. Thank you. I'm gonna link everything that I used in the description bar down below if you guys wanna go check it out. Tell them Kai sent you. Comment down below anything else you guys want me to try and I'll be sure to get to it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.